I think I had my first job that paid me anything when I was maybe probably around 13 years old. Well, first I started babysitting when I was younger, when I was in high school. And I think when I was 16, the sort of legal age where you can, can find these types of jobs, I was a cleaning lady. I went to a, the nursery business, pulling weeds. Hi, my name is Brent. I'm 16 years old and I'm from The Hague. I'm one of the youngest entrepreneurs of the Netherlands and also of The Hague. I'm offering bike tours for the tourists and the business people who are coming to The Hague. So we're now standing at the Binnenhof. The Binnenhof is uh, the political center of The Hague and also of the Netherlands. I started my company more than two years ago now, when I was 13 years old. I wanted to show the other parts of the city too, like where do the people live? Uh, where do we eat and not only uh, the highlights like our palace or uh, the Binnenhof but also the hidden gems of our city. The GES is such a big event and with such important people in the business world and in the economic world and I'm excited to see how it is and to meet all that people there at the GES so I definitely uh, look forward to it. What's important about the GES is that it looks towards the future. The challenges we have today with solutions and, and, and problem solving that is relevant for the future of young people today. We're looking for the policy ideas, our suggestions, or maybe understanding from entrepreneurs. What makes it difficult to be an entrepreneur? What, do, what policies do we need to be looking at and changing? Around sustainability, key themes, agriculture, water, health, these are issues that impact and affect all of us, wherever you are, wherever you are born. And do you think it's important to involve the younger generation into the event? <laughs> if you take a look at who the entrepreneurs are, they're the ones that understand a lot of what technology can do. All these new things that are coming into the marketplace, they're the ones that are putting this together and it's kind of like, wow, that's a great idea. I wish I would have thought of that. but. You know, when you're a little bit older, sometimes you're kind of blocked in and you're locked in by what you know. Younger people, I hope that they'll be interested and excited by the type of platform that the GES offers. They can follow it through GES TV. It may sometimes appear sort of very far away from your own environment, school, wherever you are. What's important about the GES is that it looks towards the future. You learn your life lessons early in life. Then at 13, you're learning the lessons of an entrepreneur, you're learning the lessons of a successful business person. They get drilled into you. Thank you very much. Hey, thank you. Cut seats. <laughs>